So in a previous video, I shared a tip on using the F4 key to repeat your last action. And we had several comments saying, what about the format painter? It's a great question. So here's the pros and cons of each of these techniques. So again, for that previous technique, let's say I want to uh, apply a yellow fill color to this cell here. I can then just go to another cell, hit the F4 key on the keyboard, and that's going to take that same action. And I can also do that on other cells that contain different types of number formatting. It'll still repeat that same action. If I use the format painter, I'll select this cell here and go to the home tab in the ribbon. I actually double click the format painter to put it into a locked mode where I can just start selecting cells to apply that format, which is really great. However, if I go over to another cell that contains different number formatting and apply that, that's also going to apply the number formatting of the original cell here, and you might not want that. So in that scenario there, you might want to use the F4 key over the format painter, but it's great to know both of these tools. When you're done with the format painter, you can just hit the escape key to get out of that lock mode. 